Hi, I'm Ms. Shaley. I'm a preschool teacher at the YMCA Community Family Center. Today we're going to read the book, I Like Myself. First, we're going to look at the spine. This is the spine. What it does, it holds our book together. See? No loose pages. Okay, next I want to talk about the top. This is very important because we really don't want to read our books upside down. That's not fun. So we always want to make sure this is the top. Next, we're going to look at the title. The title says, I like myself. Next, we're going to look at the author. Our author today is Karen Beaumont, and our illustrator is David Catro. Do you know what an author does? An author writes the book. Do you know what an illustrator does? The illustrator makes the pages. Let's begin. I like myself. I'm glad I'm me. Do you like yourself? I like myself. There's no one else I'd rather be. I like my eyes, my ears, my nose, my fingers, and my toes. I like me wild. I like me tame, I like me different, and the same. Those are good qualities to have. I like me fast, I like me slow, I like me everywhere I go. I can be very fast sometimes, and sometimes I can be very slow. I like me on the inside too, for all I think and say I do. Inside, outside, upside down, from head to toe, and all around. I like it all, it all is me, and me is all I want to be. Do you want to be all you want to be? And I don't care in any way what someone else might think or say. I may be called a silly nut or a crazy cuckoo bird, so what? I'm having too much fun, you see, for anything to bother me. That is very important lesson to have. You should not care about what anyone thinks about you. Even when I look a mess, I still don't look like me any less, because nothing in this world you know can change what's deep inside, and so... No matter if they stop and stare, no person ever anywhere can make me feel that what they see is all there really is to me. I'd still like me with fleas or warts, or with a silly snout that snorts. Look how crazy her nose is, but you know what? She still likes herself. Or knobby knees, or hippo hips, or purple polka dotted lips. Look at her crazy lips. They're different, and that's okay. Or beaver breath, or stinky toes or horns protruding from my nose. Or yikes, with spikes all down my spine, or hair that's like a porcupine. I still would be the same, you see. See how different she is? She knows she's different, and she knows it's okay. I like myself, because I am me.